Okay, this is going to be a, about as quick a review as I can make it. These are like the Oto, Oto, I think it's called, Minimo pen and pencil set. I mean, I, when I say small, I am talking really flipping small. Let's see. Let me let me find something to give a relative size here. Okay, so here is here is a Bic Mini. Here is a 58 millimeter Victorinox. Now let's see. Let me find a pen. Okay, here. Just because it's funny, here's here's a large Sharpie, okay? All right, you can see these are these are very 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 small. So first of all, let's look at the pen. Yeah, that that's that's some small pen, okay? And it's a weird pen because it's not a spring loaded pen; it's a pressure pen. So you push it out, and in order to get it back in, you literally just press this in. So when you're writing, if you are a heavy heavy writer, this may not work very well for you. But as long as you have it at an angle. It shouldn't be a problem. It does to require quite a bit of pressure. I mean, you might want to just like push it down with the tip like you saw to get it to go back in. And that's it. And this is, I mean, small, really, really small. So this is designed to actually fit in a credit card slot, right? You could see that that's a credit card slot and it's, it's going to fit either on top. You can even slide it if you have a like one of those slots that goes straight up and down, you could slide it right next to the cards. I mean, it's really, really small. If there's a little bit extra space, you'll have no trouble. The one I like better though, funny enough, I, I'm glad I got the pencil too. I like the pencil a little bit better. Not only is it designed exactly the way I would expect a mechanical pencil to be designed, it just feels a little bit better. Um, there's a full barrel and a spring and it, it just it just seems to work. Now, as far as writing, let's go ahead and try that. Here we go. Let's... Ooh, this actually writes very well. It actually writes very well. Nice. All right. And then, of course, the pencil. And the, this is a pencil. I mean, we know what a pencil does. Now, this does not have an eraser. So that's something of note, but that's okay. That's okay. We know that it can be erased, and that's what matters. So we have a pen and pencil set. Um, and what I found recently is when I go to have, like, do real note-taking, I have a special large notebook with a special pen that I like to write with. Um, if I have stuff in my wallet, I'm finding that I prefer just, I'm just doing it for quick signature or something along those lines. And this, I think, is going to work pretty well in a lot of cases and may make me rethink a little bit about how I set up my everyday carry as far as pens and notebooks, especially with um, a certain new product being developed by Right in the Rain. Now, there's been small notebooks in the past, but Right in the Rain just designed a notebook that is the same size as a credit card. And they're selling it in pack of six. So I'll be getting that soon. And I'm curious to see how they match up with these pens specifically. And how many different places I can put both. So I'm excited to play with it. Um, and it should be cool. Now these pens, just one, I should say something about the price. They're seven bucks. So they're not the cheapest thing in the world. But I think they're pretty slick. Especially the pencil. That one feels like seven dollars. The pen writes like a seven dollar pen but the way it works is not like it doesn't i don't know i guess i guess i i would did i actually want a clicky pen i guess i kind of wanted a clicky pen that might have been a little bit too much to ask for in this particular size frame but i mean that's if they can do it here it makes me think that they could probably have done it here i don't know if they could have done it and still kept it at seven dollars but i probably would have paid ten had it been a clicky pen i don't know Maybe just because I, I like that whole mechanism. But anyway, so here's my quick review of that. And we'll be continuing to play with it. Uh, I'll be posting pictures on Instagram about it. So it should be a lot of fun. So check them out.